Our finished product, our beautiful pumpkin bread is completely cool. It's brown, it's not burned, it's just lovely. And you've let all the steam release, so it, I know it's gonna be great inside. And look how beautiful it looks on the bottom. Now, if you wanna store this pumpkin bread, or say you had a bumper crop full of pumpkins and you made your own pumpkin puree and you made 12 loaves of pumpkin bread, maybe you wanna store it or freeze it or give it to someone. Take some wax paper and put the bread in the wax paper. I'm gonna fold it up, just like a package, just like you're wrapping a package, okay? Then you're gonna take some foil. I never like to have foil actually touch my food. You know, we talk about Alzheimer's and aluminum. You know, let's just be on the safe not side and not have the aluminum touch the food. And also it's gonna store better, especially if you're gonna freeze this bread for later in the winter to have on a cold winter's morning. So we're gonna fold up it in here. And then another helpful hint is take some masking tape and a Sharpie, pumpkin bread the day you made it, so you know how long this has been in the freezer. You just, there, it's ready to go.